Welcome to this video on the tab command command line tool. Tab command is automatically installed with server, but can be run on other machines as well. Tab command provides automation of common tasks that can be done through the user interface in Tableau server or Tableau online, such as publishing workbooks or administering users and groups. The tab command utility can be installed on any machine. To install tab command on a machine other than the server, see the online help article. It is important that any standalone tab command install should be kept up to date with the same version as Tableau Server or Tableau Online and may therefore need to be upgraded periodically. Once tab command is installed, open the command prompt as an administrator and navigate to the folder where tab command is installed. A sample command is shown here. For Tableau Server, start a session. For Tableau Online, establish an authenticated session. For this video, I'll use my local server install and log in. Once the session is started, tab command commands can be used. For a full list of commands, see the online help article. For this video, we will create some users, create a group, and add the new users to that group. To create users with tab command, we need to import a CSV file. The file should not have headers, and the columns should consist of username, password, full name, license level, administrator, publisher, and email address. The file doesn't need all of these columns, but this shows what information could be contained if desired, and the columns must be in this arrangement. On Tableau Server, if Active Directory is being used for authentication, the password column will be ignored. On Tableau Online, the username should be an email address. The password and full name columns will be ignored, but the columns need to exist as placeholders if later columns are included. To upload the file, save it in a good location, then in an active session of tab command, to import the users, the command is tab command create users, and then the location of the file. For Tableau Online, the command would be create site users. Now on the server, we see those four users have been added. Let's create a group. To create a group, the command is tab command create group, followed by the name of the group. To add users to the group, the command is tab command add users, followed by the name of the group, dash dash users, then the location of the CSV file containing the usernames. As a note, this CSV file is simply a username per row and the users must already exist in the system. Now on the server, if we go to Groups, we'll see that New Users group and it contains the four new users we added. To tidy up, we'll log out. The command is tab command logout. It's easy to export a PDF version of a dashboard or a view. The process is very similar for Tableau Server, but this example is with Tableau Online. Note the URL of the view. In the command prompt, navigate to where tab command lives and log in with an authenticated session. The dash S specifies the server or online URL, dash T specifies the site if necessary, dash U for the username, and dash P for the password. To create the PDF, the command is tab command export, followed by the name of the workbook and view, this is from the URL, dash dash what format we want to export it as, here PDF, dash F, 
and then we specify where we want to save the output. When we navigate to that folder, note we have the PDF. Thank you for watching this training video on using tab command. We invite you to continue with the on-demand training videos to learn more about using Tableau.